Welcome back to the channel. It has been some time since we've been out here at the garage. Uh, it hasn't been warm enough or we've been focused uh, out on the, the condo. But uh, today we're going to start doing a little work. Uh, one of the things that I've been looking at is so this is the combing that goes around the cockpit. And there, it's it's a comey. It's an acomey combing, um, but it's about. I guess it's about four, maybe six mil thick. Uh, it's a single. It's actually two layers, and so. I didn't cut this out when we started cutting the second boat out because I just didn't have enough acomey plywood. So one of the things that I did is. I took a look at everything that I had, and what I ended up doing was um, I'm able to make enough pieces just out of scrap. So I've got this all tied together. I do have a couple splicings in here, but that's okay because we're going to put two two rows on this, and then we're going to router this out. Uh, I'm going to go ahead. Uh, these are already finished. I've already glued these down. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and glue the other ones. And the, what I am doing is like, I'm just laminating them, I'm taking some, just taking some, some uh, tight bond glue and we're gluing them together. And then I am taking and as my template, I'm actually looking at, uh, as you can see, I've got some lines here. So I've got one piece that is solid. It, it goes all the way around, don't have any problems. And then I have another piece that are that are short. And so we'll end up taking and getting those so that they fit. And then we clamp on. I'm just using clamps to then clamp the surfaces together. So as you can kind of see how this is going together, all I need to do is have it good enough so that so that it all fits together. So I'm going to go ahead and glue these up and we'll clamp them down. Now that both of those are all glued together, uh, we'll actually let them dry. It'll be some time before they can dry, um, just because it's just going to take a while, uh, just because of the heat and things like that. But then again, we want them to dry. So I'm going to put these probably down on the ground for now, since since they are dripping. Um, got a little bit too much glue on some of those. I'm going to have to buy some more glue, but isn't that part of the game there? So let's kind of move this, and I'll show you another little piece that I ended up working on. And so here are the ones that are finished. We'll actually stick these up here. I'll wait until I have all of them done before we can come in and jeez 
What a mess. What a mess. What a mess. They're kind of... Okay. That's good enough. So one of the things that I ended up doing, I don't have this set on here straight, but I remember we were having problems just with this was in the wrong location. So what I ended up doing was just taking and being a little creative. Um, I still had more of this. And so I just kind of extended that so that it kind of matched underneath there. Uh, that's what we're going to end up doing right now is I'm going to take some of this stuff out of the way. And I think we're going to kind of tape this together and then I can kind of see how far um, that I need to sand that back so that it, it'll be a little bit more better for us to uh, sit on it straight. That one there is fine. It sits exactly where it needs to. This one here is actually shifted back a little bit. The opening. So I don't think it'll be that much, that big a deal, but we'll see. Could weight distribution, could distribution could be a little different. So I'm going to go ahead and, and kind of set this up and tape this down. And then we can kind of see how much we need to take off. So this isn't perfect, but it's going to give you a little general idea of how this is going to sit in here. Um, I'll end up getting, there's some fiber tape that I'll end up taking that and that's what I'll end up using. And I'll really get this down because this is just a temporary thing. Um, but you know, there's, there's a gap. I mean, there's almost like that much. And then of course it runs down. I've got to fix fix that. And I do know it does need to come back here a little bit. But um, you know, we've got a pretty decent overhang all along here. So that's good. Um, we may shift this. This may need to shift just a tad because there's a lot of overhang here and there's not any over here. But um, <laughs> as it kind of comes up. Uh, I'm going to take in this. I'll, I'll try to get this down a little bit more because um, I only have it down here with one and I'll put a couple of them on there. But I'm just going to take and see if I see what I can do from a sanding standpoint um, right there where that attaches to the back. Well, that was a really quick pass and it just took that down. I need to take it down a little bit more so that this is straight, but wow, it was quick. And um, then we'll take and smooth that other part out, flip it over and work on that. But um, I'm gonna keep the tape on there for now. Maybe a bad thing because it may put some stickiness on here. Uh, but we'll get it off one way or the other, whether it's sanding or what. Actually, I think I probably will take it off because I do believe that if you get that residue on there, uh, it won't take the stain well. Of course, it's not going to be stained. It's just going to be um, varnished and epoxy, but we don't want the adhesive on there. So I'm going to take that all off. I know that was a really quick episode uh, of boat building, but um, it's, we're back building the boat.
Uh, I'll end up coming back, back out here in the weeks to come, maybe even this uh, during the week. Then we can uh, continue with what we're doing. I'm gonna take put these here, allow them to dry. I'll get the mower back in here and be finished for the day. I appreciate the time you spent with us. Make sure to subscribe. Uh, hit that thumbs up if you like the content and make sure to turn on your post notifications to get all of the new episodes of the Bucket List Project condo and also the boat builds. See you later.